What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be talking about what we're going to be doing with the Duramax. So we got a lot of big plans for this truck. Um, it's going to be my daily. It's going to be my tow rig for the white truck and um, also a show truck all at the same time. Uh, I'm not going to go as far into extent as I did with the white truck but it's going to be pretty dang close. Um, so we're talking lift and um, wheels, powder coating. So um, I've been in the works with B&W hitches and they're going to be sending me out um, a flip over gooseneck hitch for this truck um, so I can haul um, the white truck to shows. And speaking of hauling, um, we're going to try to get some airbags under here. Uh, so we don't have any squat when we're hauling the truck. Um, and when we're doing all that, uh, we're going to be painting the frame, replacing the whole front end. Because um, everything's worn out, the cross members are rusted out. Um, we're also going to be replacing all the brake lines, uh, fuel lines, and um, pretty much every single line on the truck. Because uh, I don't want anything ever to leak on this thing. We're also going to be doing um, a four inch lift kit on here. Uh, I don't want to go too big. I like stock height, um, but I just wanted a little taller, make it a little, um, do a little different than my white truck. Um, for powder coating colors, uh, for the lift kit, front end parts, and uh, just other miscellaneous parts under the truck, uh, I was thinking about doing Illusion Cherry, but let me know in the comments what you, what you guys think and uh, we can figure it out. And hopefully um, after we do the lift, uh, we can work with the company to uh, get some wheels and tires on this thing. These are 22 by 14s on here right now. Um, I like them, but I uh, kind of want to go 24 by 14s possibly. And um, it'll be sitting just right. Uh, so once everything um, with the frame and the lift kit, airbags, goosenecks all done, um, we're going to be fixing all the rust on here. As you can see, it's pretty rough on the cab and uh, the doors are pretty rough. The bed's rusty and the fenders. Um, so I already got new fenders and doors. I just got to get a bed tailgate and um, I'm going to get a cow hood for the 06 front end and swap the grill out too. And then hopefully we can uh, get some Alpha Rex headlights on this thing. So um, since we're going to be pretty much replacing every single body panel on this truck, uh, we're going to have to repaint. So I'm going to be doing a metallic black on here. Uh, we're going to be color matching the front bumper, the mirrors rear bumper and possibly might keep the fender flares on um, I'm not sure yet but I always like black it's hard to keep clean but it sure looks good when it is clean so um, once everything is done on the outside uh, that's pretty much how the truck is going to sit for a little while there um, and we'll do some interior work I'm probably thinking about painting all the plastics black in here um, Definitely getting some leather seats. Uh, it already has a sound system, but we might upgrade that. Um, Retent the whole truck. Um, and do a starlight kit in there. So yeah, uh, those are the plans for the truck. Nothing too crazy. Um, just a show truck, tow truck, um, slash daily driver. So um, definitely stay tuned to the channel. Uh, we're going to be making videos all over this thing, showing... Um, our process of cleaning up the frame, um, installing the gooseneck hitch, front end parts, um, painting everything, fixing the rust, uh, doing some interior work and whatnot. Also, um, here on October 11th and 12th, uh, we're going to be hauling the white truck down to uh, Jamestown, Tennessee at Fitzgerald Performance um, with this truck. So uh, we're going to be having a uh, install video on a gooseneck hitch here soon and um, hopefully an airbag kit so 
this thing will be all ready to go down there. Thanks for watching the video, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.